All right, this is our homework help for from Wednesday night. This is our homework help from Wednesday night, okay? All right, so here we go. It says triangle LMN. These are your vertices. So I'm going to retrace like I've been doing so I can see my X and Y axis here. And this is negative 9 and negative 1, so graph that. Negative 9 is to the left. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Negative 1 is down 1. And this is L. M is negative 3 and negative 4. Negative 3 is to the left. 1, 2, 3. Negative 4 is down. 1, 2, 3, and 4. This is M. And N is negative 5 and negative 8. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and down. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8. So now what they want you to do is rotate 270 counterclockwise. Well, 270, 270 degrees, sorry, is three turns. And then it says counterclockwise, that's to the left. So you're turning to the left three times. So here I'm going to turn one time to the left, two times to the left, three times to the left. This is three times to the left right here. Okay, so when I turn three times to the left, these are my new locations for my points. It's in the second quadrant. So we have, um, let's do L. L prime is negative one and positive one, two, three, wait a minute, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So negative one and positive nine. M is negative 1, 2, 3, 4, and positive 1, 2, 3. Negative 4, positive 3. And this uh, N is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, negative 8, and positive 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Negative 8 and positive 5. So now, I'm going to graph it. We have negative 1 and up. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. This is L prime. Then we have negative 4 and negative, negative 4 and positive 3. 1, 2, 3, 4. 1, 2, 3. This is M prime. Then we have negative 8. 1, 2, 3. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and up five. One, two, three, four, and five. This is in prime. Okay. And you have rotated that object uh, counterclockwise to the left three times. Okay. Translate it. So now you're going to slide it. Translate means to slide. Um, seven units, and since it's x plus, remember x is left, right, so since it's plus, you're going to the right, so it's seven units right, and y minus two, y is up, down, minus is down, so this is going to be two units down, oops, so seven units to the right, two units down, okay? So L, seven units to the right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, two units down, one, two. New location for L, that's L prime prime. Second time, L's been moved. M, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, down, one, two. 
this is M prime, prime, second time M has been moved. Uh, in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, down, one, two. This is in prime prime. Okay. So now all it did was just translate. And I feel like I got in. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two. Right here. I felt like that. I was like, wait a minute, that's not right. Okay, that's better. All right, and so that's how you do number. That's how you do that one. Let's do the next one. You're going to graph these ordered pairs. So you got 1 and 0, start here, over 1, and 0 is right here, so this is D. Then 2 and 7, 1, 2, and up, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. This is E. And then you have 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and negative 1. F and you have two, two and negative three. One, two, three. This is G. Okay, so now you are going to move. It says translate, so slide. You're going to slide each of these points here. It says X. Remember, X is left to right. If it's minus, you're going to the left. So this is left eight units. Okay. Y minus three, that's up, down. Negative or minus is down. So you're going down three. Okay. So to the left, eight times. And three units down. So we got left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three. This is E prime. Uh, is that right? Yes. D, one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, and down one, two, and three. This is D prime. Uh, where is E? It's F. F is right. Is F right here? Yes. All right, F is right here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and then down, one, two, and three. This is F prime. G, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, and three. This is, what is that? G prime. Okay. So now you can tell all it did was just translate it slid. Okay. All right. So now reflect it over the X. So, oh, let's write these ordered pairs here. So E is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, negative 6, 1, 2, 3, 4. Negative 6, positive 4. 
D is negative 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 1, 2, 3. Negative 7, negative 3. G, negative 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Ooh, negative 6, negative 6. Um, and G, let's see, that's, that was G, negative 6, negative 6, sorry. F, 0, negative 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay. Reflection, we're going to flip it over the X. Let's flip it over this. So F, E is 1, 2, 3 above. So it's going to be 1, 2, and 1. One, two, three, four above. So it's going to be one, two, three, four below. This is E prime prime. D is one, two, three below. So it's going to be one, two, three below. This is D prime prime. F is one, two, three, four below. So it's going to be 1, 2, 3, 4 above. This is F prime prime. Starting to get a little messy. Um, did I do G already? I did this one. I did E, G. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. That's a little messy. So prime prime are the ones. Oops. Yeah, it's a little messy. Sorry. It's a little messy. E. It's all upside down. Jesus, so messy. All right, let's do 37. Okay, so 37, I'm kind of going to leave that one for you to do because I've done all the other ones for you. So for 37, you're going to do 90 degrees counterclockwise. 90 degrees counterclockwise. How many turns is 90 degrees? What's counterclockwise, okay? Dilation, scale factor is K. Is three. So what you're going to do is you're going to multiply both your X and the Y by three. Okay. All right. So if you want to go back and look at the video from yesterday, that kind of shows you how to do the dilation when we're multiplying. But I do want you to do 37 on your own. All right. Have a great evening.